Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. This is Srinivas. In this session, so we are going to discuss one SCJP or OCJP examination codes on collections. Here it is the code. So, this code represents just creating object for array list and we are storing some elements and with the help of remove method, we are deleting some of the some of the elements of the array list and here we are printing the final list. So, first execution starts from the main method. So, in the first statement we have created object for array list. The array list class is available in a util package. So, here it is util package classes are not available directly into Java application. So, we are using import statement with the help of import statement we imported that array list. And next here it is once object is ready we are storing some elements here it is with the help of loop the i value starts with a 10 and here it is of course we need to declare that integer integer i is a variable here i value starts with a 10 i is less than or equals to 100 i equals to i plus 100 so first i plus 10 i value starts with 10 10 is less than or equals to 100 condition true the control move inside it will add the value 10 10 will be converted into integer object and that will be added to list and next i value become 20 so 20 is less than or equals to 100 so like that the so total 10 elements will be stored in the list total 10 elements will be stored so this is 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 is index consider elements are 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 so like that all the elements will be stored and of course the list is pointing to this block by holding the address of the block now is a removal i value starts with zero index now i is less than list dot size so initially the size is a 10 the size is 10 so here it is a 0 is less than 10 condition true come inside list dot remove of i here we are using the remove method which is taking index as an argument so what is that index value is a 0 first so here it is whatever the element which is present in the list at 0th location will be removed first here the 10 will be removed but one thing we should understand whenever we remove the element in the first location all the elements will be shifted so 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 so like that the size will decrease the size will decrease now the size is a 9 only 9 and here the so next after removing it will increase the i value i value become 1 1 and size is also decreased already the size is not 10 it's 9 because one element already deleted so 1 is less than 9 the condition is a true come inside the list dot remove of i so i means what is a 1 so, whatever the element in the first position, first position is a 30 will be removed, 30 will be removed and here 20 is as usual, the 40 will shift to here, the 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 and here it is a size become 8. Now, I value increases to 2 and the size is decreased to 8. So, 2 is less than 8 condition true. Again the element at index number 2 will be removed here 50 will be removed so 20 40 60 70 80 90 100 the size is decreased to 7 is decreased to 7 and here the i value is increased to 3 is a condition true 3 is less than 7 condition true so here it is a third position element will be removed so 20 40 60 80 90 100 is 90 100 so this is this is and next one here the size become is a 4 and here it will become 6 the element at fourth position will be removed is 90 so 20 40 60 80 100 100 
and next the size become 5 and here it is i value become 5. So, 5 is less than 5 is a condition false. So, it will terminate. So, whenever it is printing the final list in the application the final list is a 20, 40, 60, 80, 100 right. So, this is how the program executes and what is the solution of this code hope you understood. For more videos please subscribe to Narishati channel. Thank you.